Well, hello. Um, so I'm recording this for our week seven module. <gasps> Only two more weeks left of this class um, until finals, which is really exciting. So uh, my my neighbor is mowing his yard on his insane tractor mower as slowly as humanly possible. And so um, um, I, I hope it doesn't come through a whole lot. I'm going to keep this video really short uh, as a result. So. But I wanted to do it outside because it's a beautiful day out and you know, it'd be stupid not to do that. So this week is on the Cold War. It's really only on one chapter of the Cold War. The book has two chapters, but we're just doing the first one because it honestly has the most important stuff in it. Um, the second chapter is chapter 28. You're not reading that. That's about cultural stuff. And it's interesting if you want to learn about like the effect that the Beatles had uh, or um, like the sexual revolution, the rise of film, um, that kind of thing. It's all, that's all interesting and fun, but you can read that on your own time if you're really curious. We're just doing chapter 27, which is introducing the Cold War and kind of laying out the Cold War as a conflict uh, between the capitalistic, democratic West and the authoritarian communist East. And that's basically it, right? That's like, that's the Cold War. Um, seems like ancient history to us now in 2021, but it wasn't that long ago. I was born during the Cold War um, in the 80s. And, um, you know, I, I don't remember any of it, but <laughs> it wasn't that long ago. Um, so really your book is going to be, your quiz is going to be asking you about some of the major touchstones, like what is NATO, um, who was, you know, Nikita Khrushchev, um, the Iron Curtain, which you'll also be reading about in the Winston Churchill speech for this week as well, where he kind of coins the term Iron Curtain to denote this, this kind of uh, metaphorical divide between East and West, between communism and democracy, um, and that kind of thing. Hey, you guys are doing great. I apologize if I haven't graded your particulars yet for the last week or two. I'm just snowed over with... Um, with grading last week, literally snowed over. Um, thank goodness that's a way, that's done with now. So I'll get to that this week, I promise. Uh, but if you have any questions, let me know. You guys are doing great. Keep up the good work. Um, you're killing it, you're crushing it. Go outside, take a walk, uh, enjoy, enjoy the sunshine, the birds are chirping, the, the butterflies are flapping. All right, I'm gonna end this now because my, my he's coming back, my neighbor's coming back, this tractor. All right. Uh, have a great week, guys.